This film is dedicated to all scientists, students, entrepreneurs, founders and investors in the field of biotech. Have you ever heard of NRW? NRW? NRW. Ever heard of NRW? Doesn't it stand for non-revenue water? Neutral resistant voltage? No rules resting. <laughs> <laughs> A nice try. Um, there seem to be several such abbreviations. Uh, I did not know this one. Um, NRW, of course, for me stands for North Rhine Westphalia. North Rhine Westphalia. Ah, isn't it a coal area? It's in Germany, right? It's actually in Germany. It's the most uh, populous and um, economically strongest region in Germany. Especially in the middle of the last century, the region around the Rhine and Ruhr rivers was called the land of coal and steel as it experienced a considerable economic boom thanks to its mining and heavy industry. Hammer. NRW, that is Staub, Malocha, Currywurst. That really sounds like an old word. True. And you still can see parts of the old industrial culture, but that's also a very charming element of this region. Due to the merger of very different former provinces and kingdoms, to labour migration in the early 19th century, and to its current location in the middle of Europe, cosmopolitanism is part of its DNA. It could certainly be worth a trip, but sorry, I'm researching on real DNA. Oh, she has a point. Education is the resource of the future and the motor for development. Yes, education and research not coal. Perfectly true. And that is why NRW has been transforming itself since the 1960s from an industrial to a knowledge society. This led to the largest network of academic institutions in Europe that are internationally successful, not least in the life sciences. The largest number of patent applications in the field of biotechnology come from NRW and one quarter of the direct foreign investments flowing into Germany end up in NRW. Sorry. When it comes to biotech, I tend to think of San Francisco, Boston or Singapore, or the UK if it has to be in Europe. I heard that Berlin and Munich are the leading apps in Germany. Sorry to interrupt you. I know that large monocentric cities are often better known, but you as students are also potential founders, aren't you? And NRW has a lot to show for itself. We are a state of founders, 22 business incubators, almost always in close proximity to research facilities, so that a smooth transfer of scientific know-how into marketable products and processes can take place. We are clearly in the lead in terms of the number of startups compared to the rest of Germany. And that is because North Rhine-Westphalia has a really large and polycentric structure with different clusters for agriculture, industry, medicine, or even biotech. Stop. You feel it too? What? It feels like we ended up in a commercial. Commercial? Uh-uh. This is not a commercial. It's an invitation, an offer. My name is Neil Schrader from the BioNW Network. And if, like me, you believe in the innovative power of interdisciplinary research, if you are passionate about creating jobs in newly emerging sustainable industries, if you focus on fostering young talents, on intelligent cluster policy, on cooperation between industry giants and startups, on good funding for ideas for our future, if you want to work in an extremely cosmopolitan region from which 5,000 international companies, including 1,200 Chinese alone, manage their European business, then we should definitely talk. Hello, are you still there? Could you please change my flight to Boston for one to Dusseldorf? I still think that was a commercial. But it looked kind of promising. North Rhine-Westphalia, the home of biotech.